Hey guys, my name is Richard Simmons. We're making my final Aladdin cake and I think my final Jasmine cake for a while anyways. We're making the white dress. I love the white dress. So let's get started. And make sure you hit that like button. It helps me. It does. I didn't realize how much it does, but it does. And to create this doll cake, I'm starting off with the basic doll cake steps using my Wilton's doll cake pan. I love this pan. It makes good cakes. It makes good doll cakes and a dinosaur too. I covered my entire cake with a white piece of fondant. And I just pushed it up against her waist to seal her in. So the one thing that struck me about Jasmine in the live action movie is that she has like an entire wardrobe. Belle had a lot of costume changes as well, but Jasmine's wardrobe is like completely princess. She's got these long, very bright colored dresses. Oh gosh. Let me look at that closet. Actually, I've been in the closet too long, Never mind. That's part of the reason I decided to create three different Jasmine doll cakes, which is a great segue into a commercial for my other Jasmine doll cakes. Now, if you're looking to see this Jasmine doll cake, which is blue or blue green, I don't know, it's fancy though, then there will be links for you in the description box as well as the comments. Or maybe you're looking for this Jasmine doll cake. Wow. She wears this in the movie too, I think. Um, at least I, I think from the commercials that I've seen. I give these cakes two thumbs up. Let's get, let's, let's go back to the cake. <laughs> I love the way that they translated this dress into live action. You know, the one in the cartoon is kind of just a white version of the blue dress that she wears throughout the movie. I love that they added this blue panel at the front of the dress because it is very reminiscent of the blue that she wears in the original movie. Well, actually it looks a lot more luxurious. The thing that I loved about the design of these dresses was that it spoke to a certain region of the world. And it reminds me of dresses that I see in like Southeast Asia. Or am I wrong? Probably. Tell me, am I wrong? I might be. But just the color palette of all of the gowns that Jasmine wears looks so bright and vibrant. I loved it. I feel like I was a perfect person to create all of Jasmine's dresses just because they all highlight like gold luster dust. All of them have this amazing gold detail and I love applying gold luster dust to things. And so I got to do it to all of these dresses. And with all of the detail that I had to pipe out, it looks spectacular when it's time to actually luster dust this baby. Now the panel on the side of the dress, I changed it a lot from the design that's on the actual live action dress. And that's because I had like a whole bunch of things that I wanted to use. I bought these like green blue edible gems on Etsy and I wanted to apply them to the cake so I was like I'm gonna change this just a little bit. So I glued them on and I realized that Jasmine has a lot of like peacock themed stuff which is weird because she owned a tiger. So I used some fondant molds to attach some gold peacock feathers to the bottom of the cake. Then I started to add some gold detail to her top. I don't know why piping is so relaxing to me. It's just so much fun to pipe out all of this detail. You know, you just listen to music, you have some Marin Morris playing in the background and you're just repeating that small amount of like pressure, 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 just to get all the different beads. I love that. I could do that all day. Now after I added all of my trim, I added some white pearl sprinkles just to give this baby a little bit more luxury. Look at that, how it sparkles. Then it was time to start luster dusting. Painting all of my mustard yellow icing gold. Oh, how it sparkles. What is my obsession with gold luster dust, you guys? Maybe I should do like a whole like two months where I just don't use it, but I might have withdrawal. What does luster dust withdrawal look like? Once I was finished, I added Jasmine's crown. Voila. My jasmine doll cake was complete. What? Look at that. It looks sick. I love the way it looks. Isn't it funny? Like her hair was short the entire time I was making the cake and all of a sudden it's like really long. I didn't like the short hair and I was very unsure of what to do because the cake was complete. So I took this doll and I cut the hair off 
and I just super glued it <laughs> to this one because it looks doesn't it it looks more like Jasmine she has that long flowy hair I was like I need that it's not gonna look like a Jasmine cake if I don't super glue the hair onto this doll it actually completed the look I love the way it looks and you can't tell you can't see any of the super glue isn't that crazy Good times, good stuff. Now I'm curious, how excited about this Aladdin movie are you? Was Aladdin your childhood as well? Because it was my childhood. I hope you guys enjoyed this. I love you. I will see you very soon. Peace!